Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of What's for Dinner. Today we're going to be making pizza bombs. This is a recipe that I saw on the internet, as were most of the recipes that I see. But this one is basically a biscuit with pizza toppings on the inside. Cheese and sauce and pepperoni. Our ingredients are as follows. Biscuits! Tomato sauce, mozzarella cheese, and pepperoni. There's also some seasoning and some butter and whatnot that will also go in as well. So we're going to start by preheating the oven, because if we don't, we can't do any of this. We're going to turn this on to 375. While that heats up, we're gonna prepare our pizza bombs. Cookie tray. So with the cookie sheet, we're gonna line it with some wax paper. We're gonna slightly spray the wax paper. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up our biscuits. And now we try to open it. There we go. All right, I'm gonna get our cutting board. We're gonna take out each biscuit, we're gonna cut it in half and flatten it so we can put the cheese and tomato sauce and pepperoni on the inside. Take our biscuit, cut it in half. And roll it into a ball like this. And we flatten it like so. Make sure you spread it out so that you get a good surface area or whatnot around it. I'm going to speed this up so it doesn't bore you to watch me flatten unbaked bread forever. So, once the biscuit is flattened, you're going to take some marinara sauce, some tomato sauce, and you spoon a little bit into the middle, like so. Next, we're going to take some pepperoni. Okay, take a piece of pepperoni, put the pepperoni right in the center. Then we take our cheese, tear off a little square of cheese. And then, once that's done, we close it up by pinching it closed. Tad messier than on the video, but it works. I think I might have put a little too much sauce on this one. Make sure you pinch it closed so that there's very little of any of the sauce or stuff coming out. Once we have it pinched closed, we're going to put it on the wax paper facing up like this. And repeat for however many more you want to do. I don't know how many I'm going to do, but we'll do some. But I'm going to fast forward through all of that. So you can watch me make these really fast. Here we go. <laughs> up all the available room that I have. So I have two left, but we're going to leave those in there for now. We'll deal with those later. Now the next thing, I have to add the seasonings to this. I'm going to get my Italian seasoning, some salt and pepper, and some butter. Put this in a bowl. We're going to melt some butter. Three tablespoons. Oven is preheated, by the way. I don't know if I mentioned that or not. Okay, we have our melted butter. We're going to add some salt and pepper, just a tad. Not a lot. And then some Italian seasoning, which I have yet to open, so we're going to open it right now. Very, very potent smell. And we mix it together. And then we drizzle it over the pizza bombs. Last thing, we top it off with a little bit of Parmesan. Thankfully, I still have some of the shaved Parmesan that I got from a previous recipe. And they're ready to go in. 375 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. Let's see how this goes. So it's been about 15-ish minutes or so. I checked on them about five minutes ago. I'm going to look at them again really quick. And, ooh. They're looking really nice. A lot better than I thought they would look. Gonna keep them in there for another two or three minutes. We're gonna take them out. We're gonna try them. And they are done. We're gonna take them out right now. Let's check them out here. Hey, 
They do look pretty good, if I do say so myself. I can't wait to try them out. I'm excited to give these a try. I hope they're not too hot. Let's see here how they look on the inside. They look pretty good. I put some sauce and a little bit of ketchup and some parsley to dip these in, so hopefully this will uh, add some goodness to it. So let's see if I can do this without really injuring myself. Not bad. Lots of biscuit. They're not bad at all. Well, I'm going to enjoy some of these for a short time, and I will see all of you next time on What's for Dinner. Take care and God bless.